Is it too early to be talking about the holidays just yet? Well, you know, with Ozark Mountain Christmas season here just oh, a couple of weeks away, uh, we've been talking to you quite a bit about some of the events that are coming up around Branson, one of which includes an all-new musical production called Snow Deer and written by our very own Randy Plummer here in Branson. And uh, here to tell us a little bit more about it, we've got Randy Plummer on the phone. Randy, hi, how you doing? Hey, hi, Mickey. Doing great. How are you doing? Well, can't complain much, Randy. I mean, you know what they say. You can't complain because no one listens to you anyway, right? <laughs> yep. <laughs> no. Well, you know, to tell you the truth, Randy, we're really not complaining much at all. Uh, in fact, getting kind of anxious about the uh, premiere of your new production, Snow Deer. That's uh, set to kick off here on November 17th, right? Yeah, that's right. Uh, Saturday, November 17th, yep. Very cool. And that's going to be happening here at the Nightlight Beacon uh, here in Branson. Uh, Randy, tell us a little bit about the Nightlight Beacon. Why did you pick that place to hold your show? Well, I've been friends with Buster and Julianne Prime for a while now and did some gospel singing there. And, and Ron Santuli, who sings there regularly, him and I have done a show together there. And we become friends. And anyway, uh, they were gracious enough to... Uh, uh, let us use their uh, place, the Nightlight Beacon of Branson, for the Snow Deer production. And anyway, looking forward to it. So it just kind of fell in the place. Now, that's actually a Christian nightclub, right? Yes, it is. It's a Christian nightclub, no smoking, drinking, just a good time, a place of fellowship. You can get Cokes and things to eat. And they got tables sit in there where you can sit around and talk. And, and folks like uh, Voices of Glory sing there and Ron Santuli and different people. Uh, uh, it's, an, it's just a neat place. They seat, uh, I think, somewhere around 250 people, and they have different functions in there, songwriters things, and where local people can spotlight their songs and gospel um, uh, things that meet there. So it's, it's a pretty neat place. Yeah, Buster and Julianne, pretty cool. Now, that's located in the same place where Barbara Fairchild had her diner, right? Uh, it's Yes, it is. Yeah, it wasn't in the same place, but it was in the same building. That's right. Uh huh. Victorian Village there, right, right there beside the uh, Bar Hamner Barber Theater, and across the street from Pierce Arrow Theater. Very cool. Now, Randy, you've been in Branson for a long time. Of course, with the Plummer Family Music Show and the Family Reunion shows, uh, you've written a lot of songs, including the one that we play for you here, uh, quite a bit about Branson. What is it that inspired you to write a Christmas musical? Well, I. I'm a ma first of all, I'm a major Christmas lover. I, I love Christmas oh, any day of the year. And, and uh, anyway, I had worked on another project that was Thanksgiving and Christmas oriented. Uh, it, it was called Squeaky the Mouse. And I love that project and did a CD on it. And I thought, got to thinking, you know, I ought to do something on my own and have, and I already had the plum pudding character already written and, um, and copyrighted. And everything, and I thought, you know, I'm gonna, and all of a sudden, boom, I got this idea about a little deer by the name of Snow Deer. And, and Mickey, it was amazing. I know this is God because I would write a little bit, I'd get an idea, and I'd write, go home and write it up real quick, and then I'd be playing music and over at IMAX, and I'd get another idea, and I'd hurry up and go home and type it up, and I had a paragraph or two, and I started it in March of 2011. And I just kept adding and adding and adding and adding. And now the story is around, oh, I just wrote a book on it. It's not published, but I wrote a book on it. And um, it's, I don't know, somewhere around uh, 20 pages. I'm not sure what, it, what when you put it in book form, what it averages out to. But it got to be a pretty lengthy story. I did a, C a CD on it, came out with it right before Christmas last year, a CD story CD. And it's almost an hour long. I got a cast of people and wrote up around 20 characters into my story and got a cast together and we cut it, um, at a recording studio. And then Joanne Santuli, uh, is producing it. She's the one whose husband is Ron Santuli that sings over at the night, like Beacon of Branson. Anyway, she's producing it. And, um, anyway, so most of it's in her hands and, so anyway, I've been sitting in on some of the rehearsals and stuff, and it's coming along pretty good. I'm really happy. Well, I'm glad you're happy, Randy, because I'm hoping to be able to play it here on the air during the Christmas holiday. Oh, I would be honored if you did. It would be a, be a pleasure to get those snow deer out there. <laughs> it's just a really lighthearted Christmas story. It, it adds the fun and fantasy of Christmas. But before you get done, you're going to hear, 
you'll know the real meaning of Christmas with God sending Jesus his son and the, the true meaning. So it, it adds both. It's not one of these that's going to cram a King James Bible down your throat, but it'll let you know that what the real meaning of Christmas is. And I try to mix that up where hopefully everybody will enjoy something about this production. Oh, very good, very good. Well, now, Randy, let, let me ask you, is it presumptuous of me to uh, liken this story to, say, Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer? No, it, it is not. I, I, it, it's really nothing like Rudolph. And I definitely didn't want to steal anything from, from Rudolph's story. Or, uh, uh, I wanted to be totally original. He's not, uh, he's not trying, trying to boot out Rudolph to take his job or anything. It's just a little wish that he has to pull Santa's sleigh. But no, it's not meant to take anything away from the Rudolph story or Bambi, who's off the dear Bambi. So no, this is truly an original that uh, I veered away from any of those characters. And and I love those characters, by the way, but, but no, it's nothing like them. Okay, okay. And, uh, of course, you've written all the uh, all the music for it, right? Yes, I sure did. I've got um, uh, seven original songs in it. I'm about to go into the studio and work one of the songs, uh, a, a little singing that Harvey, the reindeer elf, uh, anyway, that he sings in the play, I'm fixing to go into the studio to put it to music so I can have my seventh song. So so I've got about three weeks to get it done, get everything together. I'm working right now as we speak on a, I've got a one disc CD that has story and songs, but I'm going to, before I get done, hopefully, Lord willing, by the time we open, I'm going to have a two disc CD. One will be the story and one will be songs having to do with the story. And and seven of them will be originals. Okay. Now, again, uh, Randy, the show is coming up here on uh, November 17th and again in December, right? Uh-huh. It's going to be actually two dates in November, uh, Saturday, November 17th, and then the weekend of Thanksgiving, which is Saturday, November 24th. And they're both they're going to be 2 o'clock shows on su- Saturday afternoons at 2 o'clock. The December dates are going to be uh, December 15th, and then December 22nd. And they were both on Saturdays also, and they're also at 2 o'clock. And they're all going to be at the Nightlight Beacon of Branson there. And if anybody wants to know the, the uh, location, it's uh, on Shepherd of the Hills Expressway. It's 3044 Shepherd of the Hills Expressway, right up uh, across the street from Pierce Hill Theater, Theater and right beside the Hamner Barber Theater here in Branson. Very cool. And again, the tickets are $5? $5 for adults and $3 for kids. We've kept the price low because I want people to see it, and I don't want to charge them you know, a, a huge amount. I want people to come and enjoy it and not be worried about it being too high you know, or everything. And I've also got a number, Mickey, if I could give that to you, if anybody wants to call in regards to information for Snow Deer. Yeah, I was just going to ask you if people wanted to pre-order tickets, how they could go about doing that. Well, right now, uh, the, the one to call is Julie Prime, and she's the one, along with her husband, Buster, that had the nightlight, and she let me have her number. And anyway, it's 417-334-4839, and this is Julie Prime. She's the one taking care of the tickets, if anybody wants to call her in regards to the tickets. Okay, cool. Now, Randy, because we're on the Internet, is there a way that uh, people can get tickets online? Uh, no, we don't have a internet way of doing it, no. Well, but I do want to say that if anybody wants to find out more about Snow Deer, I've got a great big uh, Facebook page. Uh, uh, if someone wants to go there, it's Snow Deer, Christmas Story by Randy Plummer. And I've got uh, a deal with quotes from the story, pictures from the session, uh, artwork from the artwork, uh, Rain Klotfelter. Uh, he was the gentleman who painted Rain, uh, Snow Deer for me. So anyway, if anybody wants to go on there and find out more about it and everything, or if you want to order the CD, it's for sale on there for $12. And you can just send a check or money order to Randy Plummer at Box 1144, Branson, Missouri, 65615. And you can order the copy of some songs and the story of Snow Deer. Very cool. Very cool. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, don't miss your chance to see Snow Deer, produced by our own Randy Plummer. It's going to be here at the Nightlight Beacon here in Branson. Randy, appreciate you taking the time to tell us about it. Oh, Mickey, thank you very much for this interview and for helping me out with this production. This is the first. 
I'm so used to doing regular shows that this is really different doing a production, but, but I'm excited to see what's going to happen. <laughs> well, if it's anything like any of your other music shows, Randy, I'm sure it'll be a good production. So let me say, as they say in the theater, uh, break a leg. I sure will. Thanks again, and thank you, everybody out there in Radio Land. And thank you, Randy. We'll talk to you soon. Bye. That's Randy Plummer, writer and producer of the new Christmas musical, Snow Deer. It's coming to the Nightlight Beacon here in Branson. Again, for tickets, you can call 417-334-4839. That's coming here November 17th here in Branson. Look forward to seeing you. We've got more music on the way for you here in just a little bit. We're going to kick off yet another commercial free set. B-W-R.